So I was having trouble finding a way to bend inner rockers. I went to this place, um, coppersmith shop, 18 gauge steel. I told them the measurements. It's 15 millimeters up. 20 across and I pretty much asked for 35 up this way if you don't know what that is in inches times it by 25.4 anyways um, two sections of it five feet long cost me 60 bucks which is not bad so that section is pretty pretty healthy along here where the seatbelt bolts in there's a new piece going in now that's where it meets the floor I don't have the carpet pulled up in that section yet and it matches perfectly so 18 gauge steel or if you want to go heavier 16 like I said 15 mils up 20 millimeters across the shelf and whatever distance up you need I went 35 because as you can see this rocker is not that bad from this section up it was a little ripe so I decided to cut it out and I'm stopping here and then I'm gonna have to cut the rest of it and mate it up because it's all bent out of shape because somebody used it as a jacking point and pretty much wrecked it so as you can see it's pretty much deformed so I'm gonna have to reform it that's why I stopped there I'll just add another section now I'm overlapping it as you can see I don't really care because it's going to be pretty much hidden um, as long as it's strong that's the main thing uh, I was considering punching holes in it along here and I thought I won't bother because the metal's getting thinner as you go down so I'm just going to weld it on this side and then I'm going to weld it on the other side that should be more than enough to hold it so I still could have punched holes in it but whatever anyways so that's what I got going on then I'll grind off the outer rocker lip here get rid of this section and then made it up make my outer rockers finally I got this going again